Hello our most valued student, my name is Confident, welcome again to our revision session and this is mainly for those who are doing their mathematics in grade uh, 10, grade 9 and also for those who are doing their native which is N1 and also for anyone who wants to improve their mathematics and lay a good foundation, this is good for you. Let's look at this uh, section here, we want to look at basic algebra, it says remove the brackets and you need to simplify. Now, this question is 3 marks, for example, but now how do you go about to ensure that you get all your 3 marks uh, when it comes to this? Now, I just wanted to show you a few things here that you need to be aware of as you go about uh, working on this uh, uh, problem. First things first, look at the 3. The 3 is affecting everything that is inside there. And also look at the 2 brackets they are also affecting each other. So you've got the three here, we've got the two brackets. So first things is start with, as an example, let's start with the brackets to say you've got x plus one and you've got x minus two. So start with the brackets. Now, how do you multiply? When you're multiplying the brackets, the x multiplies that other x to give you x times x is x squared. The x again multiply the negative 2 so x times minus 2 it's negative 2x the next one is the 1 multiplies the x which is 1 times x which is positive you take that sign which is positive 1x and the 1 multiplies minus 2 so 1 times minus 2 is negative 2 so this is what you have but whenever you are expanding such brackets always check the center part the center two items you have got your x squared now, what is minus 1 and minus 2x plus x? Quickly take your calculator. It will always uh, come handy to say, just look at the numbers minus 2 plus x, which is a negative 1. So you've got negative 1, but the variable you're dealing with there is x. So you can use your own uh, mental, but always rely on your calculator and such. So is that and then you are left with minus two. So that's what we get here to say, if you are to write it further, equal to, now don't leave out the three. So the three is now multiplying the x squared minus one x and then minus two. You see what is happening? Then you move on then to distribute the three to say, the three is multiplying that x squared the 3 is multiplying that negative 1x and the 3 is multiplying that negative 2. So then your answer is 3 times x is 3x squared. 3 times minus 1x is minus 3x. Remember, it's 3 times negative 1. Use a calculator. 3 times negative 2. Use a calculator. It will give you minus 6. So this is what they mean when the question says remove brackets. So we just remove the brackets and we simplify.